in this 79 year old male who experienced trauma we have coronal images through the abdomen and the pelvis the imaging you see on your left side are CT imaging of the abdomen and pelvis without intravenous contrast and on the right side you have CT imaging through the pelvis after installation of cystograph and contrast through the patient's Foley catheter into the bladder. If we take a look at the images on the left side of the screen, we notice already that A, the patient has a nephrouteral stent extending from the right kidney going into the bladder, and also that there is a Foley catheter present within the bladder itself. Notice already that there is free fluid around the liver and along the pericolic gutters bilaterally. All of this free fluid is located within the peritoneum. If we look at the imaging on the right side of the screen after injection of contrast into the bladder, notice that we see contrast extravasation into the peritoneal spaces surrounding loops of bowel within the right pelvis and abdomen and along the pericolic gutters as well. Notice also that along the right lateral margin of the bladder there is a focal area or a defect of contrast extending from the bladder interluminally through the wall and then into the peritoneum. These findings are all compatible with an intraperitoneal bladder rupture. It's important to make this diagnosis as this is a surgical indication for repair of the bladder as opposed to an extraperitoneal bladder rupture which is treated conservatively and is associated more often with pelvic fractures which we did not see in this case. Notice also that this bladder is very trabeculated with uh, thickening of the bladder wall as well. So these findings again were consistent with intraperitoneal bladder rupture which did require surgery in this patient. The key to making the diagnosis of intraperitoneal bladder rupture is noticing contrast extravasation from the bladder in the peritoneal spaces, so along the pericolic gutter and also outlining loops of bowel within the abdomen.